sort of your thoughts about tonight playing out like yesterday and how frustrating and disappointed is it not to respond? I mean, this is competition, and we're going to work together until we get this breakthrough. Um, you know, these are painful moments. Uh, you know, we had a, an opportunity in both games. Um, and you don't know necessarily if, if you can finish your defensive possessions, you know, with a rebound, um, whether you're going to win or not. Um, but th that is our hurdle for this moment in time. You know, we, we've rebounded great, you know, for the majority of the season. For whatever reason, this little pocket right now, uh, it's um, been troubling for us. And you know, the defensive efforts and disposition, um, you know, is adequate. I, I was encouraged by uh, the commitment to do hard things um, against a very good offensive team. Um, you know, if we could have finished off a couple more uh, possessions, you, we might have had an opportunity to hold them under 100. Um, uh, and that's not easy uh, in today's game and the way they uh, drive and attack and uh, the skill level. Uh, and they also can keep you honest uh, at the three-point line. Um, I thought the attention to detail, um, the physicality, the force, uh, and the efforts were there. Uh, it just was very similar, you know, down the stretch. Uh, it looked like we had opportunities, you know, to secure the ball, but um, weren't able to do it. And you have to give them credit. And they also knocked down shots after that. It almost looked like a misprint. You know, we basically had the same amount of offensive rebounds. Uh, we end up with less than 10 points off of those offensive rebounds. They have 23. I had to look at it, you know, three or four times, but. Um, but my gut felt like it was 30 uh, off those nine offense rebounds. So we'll get better from this. Um, you know, there were a lot of good things to take away. None of us want to talk about it or feel that or, uh, you know, um, whatever, you know, right now because we're competitors. But by the time we get back to Miami, uh, even the head coach, you know, can see that there are some good things, you know, happening in our locker room. To step up and sort of fill in what maybe others were struggling. Yeah, we really needed it, you know, because we, we uh, put a lot into the game physically and emotionally last night. Uh, and that's not an excuse at all. Like, our, our guys were ready to compete and, and put it out there tonight. Uh, but, you know, there wasn't a lot of juice, you know, th you know throughout the rotation. But Jaime, um, you know, was able to give us a, a lot of relief points. And also during key moments of the game, we could throw the ball to him, kind of settle in. Uh, in a similar way that we were doing, you know, we, what we do with uh, Jimmy. Um, and that allowed us to catch our breath, get to spacing and play out of, you know, their aggressive uh, defense. And it also, you know, says a lot about his, his mental toughness, you know, to be able to have that kind of performance on, on the second night of a back-to-back. -back. And your thoughts on Patty Mills' heat debut? Yeah, that, that was great to see him uh, finally do it in a heat uniform instead of against us. Um, we've seen that for too many years. Um, you can see, you know, why he's been able to do what he does. He's ignitable. He's smart. He's been in a lot of uh, very good systems, so he knows how to fit in, even though he hasn't had to practice. Uh, Fifteen years uh, in, uh, it's all the same kind of stuff. He can play his game. He helps our best players. Uh, he was able to to really help that that unit we had in with uh, Jimmy and Nico, and um, that's something that uh, you know will definitely add to our depth. Filled out the rest of the box score was off with his shot. Was that something they were doing? Is he in a little bit of a funk right now based on last night and tonight no. offensively? You know, sometimes these things happen, but he's a competitor. He knows how to, to impact, you know, the game. And they're committed, you know, to take the ball out of his hands, uh, you know, particularly out of the post. Um, you know, in the pick and rolls, they're switching, so we couldn't necessarily get him the ball in the sweet spots. Uh, so he wasn't able to get some easy relief points and, um, you know, but he did a lot of good things. And, and that's why, you know, it's, these are great opportunities to, to win a game on the road with your C game. You know, if, if we're not at, at your best, you know, that, that you can still find a way to win. We weren't able to do that tonight, and so we, we live with the loss. All right, thank you.